Okay, why don't you go ahead and come over here. Hi, my name is Becca. In my life before Christ, I had anxiety and I never felt complete or content, no matter how successful or perfect my life appeared. Recently, I struggled with postpartum anxiety, which became worse at the start of the pandemic. I felt desperate and I began to pray every night. I kept asking God how I could help others during this challenging time. He responded by revealing to me the very real spiritual battle taking place behind the scenes. I was more confident than ever that there really is a God and that true evil does exist. As I searched for ways to grow myself spiritually, the devil deceived me into new age practices. The harder I searched in the world for answers, the more lost I became. At my lowest point, God placed me in the hands of a Christian therapist who helped me redirect my attention back to Christ. As I dug into scripture, I learned a few things that changed me forever. One, that fear is not from God. And two, that we have power over the enemy. Second Timothy 1 7 says, God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. A friend prayed the sinner's prayer over me, and in that moment I could feel his love, his forgiveness, and his pure heart. And that was the beginning of my repentance and the shedding of my old life. My anxiety has since disappeared. I have peace that surpasses all understanding. I feel joy even in the midst of this broken world. And I am so grateful that I get to walk through the rest of my life with real and purposeful faith in the Lord. Today, I confess into the church and to all the world that Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior. Amen. Amen. two simple questions. First, do you believe Jesus has done everything necessary to save you? Yes. And are you willing to go wherever he wants you to go and do whatever he wants you to do? Yes. Amen. Once in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, I baptize you, buried with Christ and raised to walk in a new life.